Hey everyone, we're looking down the western segment of US 20. And what I mean by the segment is that this portion of the road, if I were to travel from this location in West Yellowstone, Montana, would go all the way to Newport, Oregon. And what I mean by the segment is that over here, Yellowstone National Park splits up the road. So a driver would have to continue down this road to the western entrance, just a few hundred meters down the road, and then go through unnamed roads and Yellowstone National Park, and then exit through the eastern part of the park, and then continue on US 20 all the way to Boston, Massachusetts. So that's the longest road in the United States, 5,415 kilometers long. So here we are looking north of the border here. So right now I am facing north and on the left side is Montana. On the right side is Montana, but this portion of Montana is controlled by the federal government. This is Yellowstone National Park. So this is the boundary right here. Right now I'm subject to state law. Now I'm subject to federal law. Quite an interesting experience. As you can see here, this is the south facing portion heading towards the western entrance. And there's rules. There's the boundary line. No hunting allowed, of course, in the national park. But yeah, over here, again, like I say, I'm subject to federal law. Uh, one of the interesting things I saw over here is somebody walked their dog over from those hotels and walked into the national park and let her dog go to the restroom in the park. Uh, according to the rules here, you're not supposed to walk your dog anywhere where your car cannot go in the national park. So technically that's a federal crime, but I don't think anybody's really enforcing it right now here. She could have just taken a few steps over here to the Montana side and been perfectly fine. Yeah, it's an interesting geological oddity, but again, um, beautiful part of the park over here. This is Yellowstone, the western portion of it. I could continue walking on and on and on here for a long time. Or if I face this way and walk a little bit or drive a little bit down the road over on the western side of the entrance over there, I would enter, I would enter into Wyoming. So drove up from Wyoming, came out through Idaho, and then passed into Montana to stay out here for the day, which I will enter into the park tomorrow. So it's an interesting area. Here we go. Federal jurisdiction, state jurisdiction, federal jurisdiction. Not sure what this is. Okay, thanks for watching everybody. Take care.